Good morning and good night, Flippin' Rabbit family. Today I am bringing you another educational content video. Today's video is going to be about how to set up a ledger, how to keep your assets safe, and never miss a single one. Okay, if you guys didn't already know, the main reason we wanted to make this video is we've been wanting to make it for a while. We've pushed up on the timeline because of everything happening with Solana. Just like that, there was over 6,000 wallets hacked. Their seed phrases were gone, and we look at it, and it was from Slope. We're not sure how it happened. There's still more investigation going on, but this is another reason to always have a cold wallet. That's not a hot wallet. If you don't understand the difference, a cold wallet is fully offline. So you're in control of everything. The sad part is if you have a phantom wallet or a glow wallet or a slope wallet, if they get your seed phrase, you're screwed. The nice thing is everything goes through you with the ledger. So right now, since everything did happen, ledger is actually giving us a promo code. So move soul to ledger for 10% off. I will be linking that down below. So there's kind of two different ones that are the main ones. There's the Nano X and the Nano S Plus, which is kind of their newest version. The main difference is one has a little bit more capability for cryptocurrencies along with Bluetooth connection, which is the Ledger Nano X. So you don't need a cord to plug in. The other one is the Ledger Nano S Plus. I fully love the Nano S Plus. I'll be showing you how to use it in this video. And it's great for NFTs and it's very simple to set up. So personally, since I've already set up my Ledger Live and my Nano S Plus, I'll be kind of skipping that portion because obviously I'm not going to show you my seed phrase. But the great thing is the seed phrase is 24 words, which is double the amount of any hot wallet or online wallet, which is great, along with having the capability of saying, hey, this is me. I approve or I don't approve. So what you'll be doing is going to ledger.com start. There's two different options. You can obviously have it for Windows, uh, Linux, or you can also have it for Mac. Um, I personally have two different ledgers. So I have a Nano X and then a Nano S Plus on my Mac and my PC because you can never go wrong with too many ledgers. I feel like two to three is perfect. And the nice thing is it's 10% off and they're only $80. I personally feel like if you have over $200, please get a cold wallet. So once you are done doing that, you'll be able to come to Ledger Live. This is the program that you download first. You plug in your ledger here. They'll say, hey, I want you to set up a pin code, which will be six to eight different combinations. I love it because they're already starting off with security very strong. The next thing is there'll be a 24 word seed phrase that you'll be writing down. Obviously, I would write it down on a bigger uh, piece and I always keep mine in my safe. Uh, they do give you this tiny little one. <laughs> I personally have big handwriting, so that doesn't really work best with me. But yes, the, the great thing is you put your NFTs in it, you put in your safe. If I'm not using it, then I'll put it there. And I don't touch it. Uh, thankfully, I haven't been hacked since. I did lose over 90 soul, which is very sad. I did learn from my mistakes, and now I'm a full supporter of Ledger and Cold Wallets, and this is why I love making this video. So basically you're set up, you're good to go. It will be coming to this screen. The next step you'll be going to is manager. And this is where you actually add the different type of things. So right here, boom, unlock your device. Please put in your pin code. Okay, just put in the pin code. So now it should load. I do like how it does take extra precautions. It is kind of annoying at times, but I would rather have more security and not have to worry about anything. Okay, so obviously there's a crap ton of cryptocurrencies, but we'll be looking at Solana. So go over here. Uh, you can obviously, so this is where you're actually able to add multiple different Solana accounts. I personally have two on each wallet. Um, you'll just hit install just like here. It will take a little bit, then you just have to approve it on your um, Nano. And the cool thing is you just press these two little things right here. So both at the same time, and that's how you approve. So it's very, very simple. So the next thing is you just want to go over to portfolio just to make sure. Obviously, there was some Lana um, a while back. Then we can go over to accounts just to double check. So I have one with $3. Um, so we have the two wallets right here. Obviously, this says NFTs number two. This is what I'll be using for the video. So basically, the next thing is you just download Phantom and you add it to your extension. This can be used in 
I believe, uh, Chrome or Brave Browser. I personally use Brave Browser. I feel like it's a lot better overall. Um, so right here, you can just look at it you're like, oh my gosh, this is so cool. It supports Ledger. Yeah, so Chrome, Brave, Firefox, and Edge. Actually, more than I thought. And you literally just click it, and then you can just add it, and it'll be on the very top right. So I already have mine here. So this is what I want. So it's my main wallet. Um, you always want to have very little Solana just in case it is hacked. But this is why we add the ledger because then nothing can happen. So the first thing is you'll be going to this little hamburger up here on the top left. Click on that. I already have my first ledger here. I will just show you. So obviously this is 306. It matches what I have on my ledger live. This is where I store all my flipping rabbits. Oh man, did I pick up a bunch at 0.6. I went a little ham. <laughs> okay, so what we'll be doing is right here. So add slash connect wallet. It says, hey, do you want to create a new wallet, import a private key, or do you want to use a ledger? We want to use a ledger. So click on hardware wallet. Say, hey, we are checking for a wallet. Um, the good thing is you just want to hit continue and since you have your ledger already plugged in you should be good to go it's a very simple process okay this is right here hey we found your nano x hit connect okay open up solana app it will basically say on your ledger you just have to double click okay so sometimes it can take a little bit so always hit refresh so it'll say ledger nano perfect looks like it's good to go we just hit continue It'll say, hey, we want to select which wallet address. We're like, okay, perfect. So what we'll be doing is you're going to 445010. And it'll say, hey, we're going to try and find it. Searching. And there it is right there. So Q5P. Add account. Account added. And then if we go over to Phantom, say, hey, we found it. Ledger 2. I always like to just rename my stuff. So I'll just go to... Um, NFTs number two and I'll show you how easy it is to basically put NFTs in the wallet and you can just leave it so I'll be adding some so you literally could just copy this right here go over to a wallet with some Solana send some over okay perfect we already sent some Solana over we can go back and then let's actually just send a NFT right now so this is my main wallet, um, kind of just a lot of different stuff on it. Let's just send over a, let's go with a Moonling. So we'll go here, we'll hit send, paste the address of the wallet we just made. Next, very little gas fees, call of Solana. Boom, sent. I love how quick it is. <laughs> okay, then we go back to the hamburger. We go very back to NFTs number two. We click right here and then it should actually it'll probably take a little bit so i just open up the app again there's the solana we just deposited you can always go here and see looks received you got your moonly and there we go so that's how easy it is to set up a ledger or a cold wallet on phantom but when you are trying to stake an nft or send nfts or crypto or solana out of that wallet you physically need to approve it and that's what makes it a cold wallet so no one else can touch it and you will be safe no matter what so i just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video hopefully you found it entertaining and very easy to walk through i tried to make the process easy as possible i like to make videos simple and easy just like i said before so thank you so much for watching and i'll catch you on the flippity flip